Hi, my name's Jake and I'm a volunteer at the Institution of Mechanical Engineers and I'm here today to tell you in this video about how you can engage a group of young people in science, technology, engineering and maths whilst building a CD racer. This activity is suited for all age ranges and will take about 20 to 30 minutes to run and can be run individually or in teams. By building a CD racer, the young people will be learning about concepts such as friction and how it can be helpful and unhelpful, why different materials affect performance and how we can use distance and time to calculate speed. The beauty of this activity is that the young people will be learning about all of these concepts whilst having fun. Now we will show you how to make your CD racer. The first step is to take the glue and place it around the first CD and once you have done that, press the cotton reel down on it ensuring that you can see straight through. Again take the second CD and place the glue around that and then again press it on ensuring that you can see through both holes and allow that to dry for five minutes. Once it is dried and you can see through both holes, take your paper clip and create a hook. like that. And when the paper clip is on the elastic band, poke it through the hole to the other side and pull it through both of the CDs. Now, making sure you are holding one side of the elastic band, place the washer onto the elastic band and then place the pencil through the elastic band to secure it on that side. On the other side, place the rubber strip, yellow side down, and then you are ready to start racing your racer. And that's it. Easy, right? Now that you've run one of our activities, why not check out other simple ways to get young people involved in STEM activities in the description below. Here you will also find full step-by-step -step instructions on how to build your CD racer, a link to where to get the materials to build your CD racer, and then the health and safety stuff. If you do have any questions or any hints and tips, feel free to put them in the comment section below. Also, if you'd like to see more activities like this, then don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and have fun racing.